Hey, it's holiday survival time. Uh, we are doing the follow through. I'm Pastor Fred and uh, we are on tip number 22. A uh, weird shift has occurred. We, we, we've gone from Christmas uh, to moving towards New Year's, but we bring that Christmas joy. We bring all that Christmas spirit. We bring all of these tips and all these survival things into that new year, right? And, and what, what the tip is going to be for today is to reflect. Uh, not to dwell on the past, not to get stuck there, but to really reflect. And I want us to reflect on all that God has done for us. Romans 8, 28 says this. Paul says, And we know that for those who love God, all things work together for good, for those who are called according to His purpose. Right? So we should have like this unbelievably long list of, of things that God has done, His faithfulness, how He has shown up day after day, time after time, situation after situation, shining light in the darkness, helping us, reminding us that we're forgiven, reminding us that His Son died for us, and that's the reason for this season, uh, is that we would be saved from sin and death. That, that Jesus came to do that and came to bring us a life that will never, ever ever end. And so those things alone are worth reflecting on as we look into the past. Because we might see some stuff that we regret. We might see a whole bunch of mistakes, a whole bunch of things that like, man, and then there's just resolve to do better next year, which is great. But we got to realize that that the things that are going to change are going to be because God changes them. Us, our hearts, our lives. He's transforming us. Let's lean into that. Let's look to that. Let's reflect and say, Lord, when have I resisted you? Lord, when have I, right? Because I got to own that. I can't just say all these bad things happened to me. And, and that might be true, but there were a whole lot of things that, that happened or didn't happen because of me. Uh, and so I want to look back at and, and own my unfaithfulness, own my uh, inability to trust God sometimes and, and, and just the times I blew it. I needed not you know, rationalize it or explain it away, but just say, Lord, please forgive me. Lord, let, you know, how is next year going to be different? Um, how am I going to get into the Word of God more? How am I going to pray more? What, what's going to be my plan? Uh, right? And we're going to get to that, I think, next time um, as we get further in the week. But for right now, let's, let's reflect, like, how is my faith growing? How is God, how good has He been to me? All right, so make a list. Right? Look at it. Share that with somebody. Discuss that. Get their list. And, and, and let's have a fun kind of exchange of the blessings that God has given to us. All right? This is the follow through. Great to see you. I'm glad. I'm hoping this holiday guide is helping you. And uh, we've only got a couple more left. So uh, hit that subscribe button, share this, and we will see you next time.